everyone assalamu alaikum so here we'll take a look what is log writer callback and how to use it well first thing you have to have this get metro app and uh, inside this you have to enable log true and then you have to have this log writer callback and it refers to a function before we see the function actually let's see what we would be able to see because of this function let me walk you through now here is our app over here now this is a simple chatting app that I created now over here as you see that chat controller on delete call and is error or false and also deleted from memory and there is no error well that's a good thing no error right now, if I click on this or like say for example if I click any of this over here now we see once again that chat controller has been created and initialized now here is error false is error false now this messages they're coming because of this log writer callback so if you have log writer callback enabled then you'd be able to see the messages as controllers are initiated created and at the same time if we have any error or not now we'll restart the app from the scratch to get a better idea now as you see that well here we have a lot of this controllers including get material controller has been created and the error is false down there we see the same different kind of controllers they are created and the error is false so the same when you go to different pages and if different pages have different controllers so it gets called this messages because of this log writer callback now it's not as simple as that the way you're thinking so here we just enable it but we need to do one more thing with this function actually it's a callback function if you click on this you'll see that here inside this static class inside this class we have this static function now this is the function that we are calling or referring from here and it takes a string and a boolean now where are they coming from getx will take care of this automatically all you need to do have a function and the function itself has a string and a boolean and based on that you can print the whatever the way you want so now as you see that like for example this one refers to this section over here text right so it has been created and then is error is false okay all right so log writer callback is great for debugging keeping track all of your controllers as they get created and instantiated as well as as they get deleted so you know which one is being deleted which one is causing error just like that thank you